Well, what's up, you guys? Dagger back with a uh, sto story, I guess. A story, yeah, story. We're we're gonna go into a story. Now I gotta think of a story because um, I wasn't quite prepared for this. So, yeah, let's um, I'm gonna think of a story real quick. But in the meanwhile, before, oh my God, my desktop. <laughs> okay. So, anyways, um. Before I get to going, I'm going to say this. I've gotten a little tired of doing ARC, so what I'm going to do is a new series. So it's going to split between ARC and this series. Now, I'm not going to spoil anything for fans that watch, but I think it may help a little bit with the variation of content. Now, with that being said, what we're going to do is... uh. Slow it down, and every other Friday will be ARC, and every other Friday between that will be the new series. So it'll have variation, but since I'm talking story time, why don't we talk about the weird guy I had in my first hour this last year. So, typically, you know... In school, you find there's some pretty weird people. And, you know, these people, y you look at them and you're like, oh my god, that that's what happened? But, um, let's, let's just go into this and say it this way. So, you know, I go to class the first day of school and, you know, just like everybody does, or maybe not everybody does it. I don't really care. I don't care if you do or don't. Whatever happens, happens. But sit down in my seat in the back corner of the class, and this dude comes and sits beside me that I know from previous years. Now, this dude, he dresses and acts like a stud, but he's, but he's not. But he's not. And he spikes his hair back, slicks it back, and he thinks he's such a stud. Okay, so, you know, a few weeks go by, you know, everything's normal. You know, he's he's the guy that has to ask for paper, to borrow paper. What happens is he, he's just constantly asking for paper, and, you know, he he's a slacker. He doesn't really do his work. And he always sleeps in class. Well, one of the days, this was very disturbing, but what I think is weird about it is that in the middle of class, we're watching a movie, you know, just having free time. Oh my god. I, I will never, rem I, not say remember this, but never forget this. I look over, and some dude beside him is asking for paper so I look over what I see is oh god it's terrible but you know it, it's not as bad as some things in high school could get but he's sleeping with his hand in his pants I'm thinking are you kidding me are you freaking kidding me in the middle of class. Dude, don't do that in the middle of class. Sleep with your hand in your pants. <laughs> I'm sorry, but... Sleep it with his hand in his pants. What in the world? Now, I don't want to say he's the weirdest person I've met, because that would be a lie. But... Just the way he acted. He acted like, you know... <laughs> He acted like he was a stud, and he acted like he was the coolest dude around, but in all reality, just, oh my goodness. Like, he had a lot of friends in that class, but that just creeped me out. He was sleeping with his hand in his pants. He was leaned back up against the wall with his feet up on the desk, and I don't understand why. Why? Why was he doing that? But I didn't want to know. I don't want to know. 
I never will want to know. But that will not be able to leave me ever. That will never leave me. So, you know, luckily, I didn't have to take the test at the end of the semester. We get exemptions and stuff for good grades and all this stuff. He had to take it because he missed like 10 days of school, which is, whoo, my goodness. But, anyways, you know, I hope I don't have him next, uh, next semester in my class. Now, with all luck, you know, Christmas is coming up, and my birthday is going to be on Thursday, so I may do a little video there with, uh, Shane, Wes, and Matt, and some of the other guys. So... You know, be looking forward to doing some videos with them. And, you know, otherwise than what's, uh, you know, what's happened, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. This is a short one, too, I realize. But, pardon me for that. Um, but besides that, you know, I really am happy with the amount of support I've been getting recently and... I want to thank you guys, and hopefully, you know, we continue to grow and continue to prosper as a community and as this channel. And, you know, I hope you guys continue to enjoy my content. So, please don't forget to slice that like button, subscribe, comment, whatever you want to do, as you see fit in your own ways. Otherwise than that, Peace out, you guys.